So there's a new drone on the block, and it's not from DJI. The Femi X8 Telemax is here, and while Femi might not be a household name, they've been around for a while with models like the Femi Mini 3. Now, their latest drone is making some noise with a dual camera setup, long range transmission, and additional features. But is it worth it? Let's break it down. Let's start with cameras, because this thing has two. The main camera is a 48 megapixel f1.6 shooter with a half inch sensor, offering solid low light performance and crisp image quality. It captures 4K at 60 FPS with HDR support for better dynamic range. The second camera is a telephoto shooter with a 120mm focal length 35mm equivalent, enabling a 6x optical zoom and up to 30x digital zoom. This means you can get tight shots from far away without losing much detail. The dual camera system allows for seamless switching between wide and zoomed perspectives, making it versatile for different filming scenarios. On the flight side, the X8 Telemax is built to perform. Weighing in between 760 and 832 grams depending on the battery, it's not your lightweight micro drone. It climbs at 5 meters per second, cruises at up to 18 meters per second, and can handle winds up to 12 meters per second. Um, battery life ranges from 38 to 47 minutes depending on conditions. Stabilization is handled by a gimbal, meaning smooth footage even in windy conditions. You get 4K at 60 FPS time lapse recording, GPS supported tracking, and flight planning. Plus, you can add extra modules like a speaker or a 4G modem if you want more versatility. And let's not forget the Rocklink 5.0 system, which boasts an insane 20 kilometers or 12.4 miles transmission range. The X8 Telemax comes with a redesigned remote controller that offers low latency transmission, ensuring a smooth flying experience. On the intelligent side, you get features like AI-enhanced tracking, smart return to home, and automated flight planning. While it lacks advanced obstacle avoidance, its intelligent flight modes make capturing cinematic shots easier. Unlike some high-end drones, the X8 Telemax doesn't have full-on 360-degree obstacle avoidance. Instead, it relies on a downward vision system for landing assistance and stabilization. There's no fancy LiDAR setup or omnidirectional sensors, so you'll need to be extra careful when flying in tight spaces. The X8 Telemax isn't officially available everywhere just yet. If you really want one, you'll have to import it for around $525. The good news? Shipping is free and import fees are included. The bad news? It's coming straight from China, which means delivery could take up to two months, and if something goes wrong, Let's just say warranty claims might be tricky. Would you take a chance on this drone? Drop your thoughts in the comments. And if you want more drone coverage, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Catch you in the next one.